Hi everyone, in this video I want to show you how to translate your URLs log and how WPML works with Rank Math. Now also with the automatic translations and as you can see here, I already have installed WPML and these are the basic plugins that you must have installed and activated. Also, it's really important to have the WPML sale so that it's actually working properly. If you cannot find where is this area, you can just go here to the add new and in the commercial tab, you can find, find the WPML plugins that might be included as also add additional features to the basic or main plugin. You can go here to the WPML and then after making all the setup of the configuration of your WPML, you can just start creating and making the other important setups for the international SEO. One basic and important thing that you must have is go here on settings and set up the advanced translation editor that it's way better than the classic. You can also have the automatic translation, but also it is important that you have here in the translated documents options to have the translate option here on the page URL. In this way, you can also translate the slugs because if you have the auto generate, like from the URL or the mainly translation, you might not have the same URL or the keyword on your URL. So if you want to optimize properly for international SEO, it's also important to have the proper URL. So if we go here to any post, let's create one. We will have here this example of managed cloud hosting platform. So you will have to create the translation. Here I have the Spanish example, but in your case, if you're using it for German, for Indonesian, Indian, or any other, you can actually also do that translation for any other type of language. So basically we have here the Spanish area. We can start here the translation. In order to have the automatic translation, we'll have to set up the, do the proper automatic translation. But in just for showing to the, how to translate the URL, I'm just going pretty fast. Just let me change here to the word hosting. And then also, this is a tip that I use to save some credits. If you haven't seen my other videos about WPMR and how to save credits, we can actually hosting. It's basically cloud hosting. And As easy as that, we already have the translation. Okay, so we have here the basic page and I have here the simple menu. And just to show, we already have here the URL. Of course, if you are aiming for any other keyword, you can do the proper work. So now let's see and work for the rank math SEO. Okay, so if we go now to the basic post, we can go here to the SEO and let's just write or let me just copy here, have this text and update. So we have, let's say, our proper description. If we go back here, we go to the update. Now you can see here that it appears the rank math descriptions. So if also you need to add some certain type of keyword inside your description or even also in Yoast, not necessarily also in rank math, you can see here the part. You can just change the text or add here instead of this word, let's say. Let's say that I want to 
change it and you will have the proper description now so let's go back to see the page we have it here we go to spanish we will have to go here to the code and as you can see here we will have already the hre flanks they are already set up you don't have to do some more coding or more special things so that the proper HRE flanks are set up with the corresponding language. For example, here we have English and we have Spanish. But as you can see here, we have the proper title that it's in the, the language in Spanish. And here we have the description also in Spanish. Of course, if you have the, any other language, you will have the proper set language. So you don't really have to really worry about that. Basically, WPML makes all the work. You just have to go to the Automatic Translation Manager. And also, they will work properly with Rank Math or Joost in case of any other international SEO techniques that you want to make sure you're covering. So I hope that this video helped you to know how to translate your URL. It's really easy. It's really simple. Also, to translate your metadata, it's really fast. So if you have any questions or have some comments about, about WPML, don't hesitate to write in the comments. Thanks for watching.